everybody, welcome to the Godcast. I am your host, Hydrave99. I'm here with Ghost Weather Game and Flu Falpaca. How is everybody doing today? Uh, I'm doing great, I guess. Thank you, thank you. And how about you, Ghost Weller? It's been 10 minutes. <laughs> you know, it's funny. <laughs> you know, actually, it's been 14 minutes and 50 seconds. You know, what's funny is actually, believe it or not, so for the audience out there who doesn't know, this is actually a third take on this recording. And so... Literally, if it's the funny thing is that when we were talking on the second one, it's like, dude, you won't be up at 10 o'clock in the morning for this. So, and this is like a little translation of that. So it's actually kind of funny. Dude, you had me sitting here for like two fucking hours <laughs> to get this fucking podcast on. And, and either one of our mics took a shit later on. Right. My mic isn't on superior. Right. Yeah, yeah. I yeah, you're black web one. I hear you. I'm actually using a Logitech C302 mic. Oh. I'm actually just using a karaoke mic. (laughs) No, you're using your webcams mic. No, not even that. I'm just... No, no, you're using, uh, you're using a, uh, uh, what, uh, Dollar Store mic. I was gonna say, these fucking Dollar Tree mics are going wonders. (laughs) (laughs) I see, I see. Oh, Canada. All right, so shall we get started and shall we let the people know like what this is? My my pop filter is just a fucking brush. <laughs> it's a pantyhose. <laughs> it's a fucking floofer. It's a stretched pantyhose as your as your uh, uh, pop filter. <laughs> All right, so besides alpaca's picture like fluckering, um, let's introduce- it's just jeans. Right. Excuse me. <laughs> It's flickering. <laughs> On my end, but anyways, let's get going here. Uh, so, how about this? This better? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so for those who won't know, um, our good friend Floof Alpaca is going to randomly flip between different images as the episodes go on. For the first one, he's going to leave as a profile picture, but in like episode one, etc., he's probably going to leave like different images up as the podcast goes on. But yeah, for now, I just have like. The Godcast, the, the the finished one. Yeah. <laughs> mm. All right. So, what is Godcast, everybody? Like, what is Godcast? All of our names put together. That's yeah. It. <laughs> you know, that's that's one thing we never mentioned on the early recordings. I'm glad we just redid it because, you know, the first recording, I was feeling it, but I wasn't feeling like you know I wasn't very uh, what the hell is it called? Like I wasn't very attenuative. Second one, I was very tentative, but at the beginning, I was, like, beyond depressed. <laughs> I'm very tempted just to shotgun a bang right now. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. So, what anyway. is... Yeah, so, what is Godcast? What is the show? It is a new and exciting podcast that primarily talks about technology, gaming, and any other things that interest us. Hydro 99, Ghost Weather Game, and Blue Falpaca. So as we can see here, there's Ghost Weather Game, Blue Alpaca, and myself, Hydrowave99. Yes, all hail us. <laughs> and the details and the structure, like how is this show going to flow exactly? Well, the podcast will primarily be about technology and gaming news with other segments such as answering viewer questions and some other, like playing a multiplayer games. This is the overall flow of the podcast. We greet each other first, so kind of like what we did earlier in the video. And then we talk about the news and topics, and afterwards we'll answer viewer questions and suggestions about the podcast. And it'll be recorded every Saturday, well, besides today, because we literally had to record this three freaking times, and it would be uploaded on Sundays. So this whole podcast will be uploaded on my Hydro 99's YouTube channel, and will be eventually be on all major podcast platforms. So I'm going to look into the logistics on how to get to all them on like Apple Podcasts, Spotify, etc., etc., and there will be occasional uploads of highlights and parodies of the podcast. So rest ensured that, you know, if you miss out on, like, something major, we'll definitely do something. And I know that one thing I plan on doing is that one of our failed recording sessions was us talking about Windows 11. I'm going to upload, I think, the second clip of the, just the Windows 11 portion on my channel, despite its echo and problems. So 
we're gonna we're gonna talk about something different today. Yep. Do you want me to start that conversation? Go for it. All right. So for those of you that don't know, there's a heist. This is not. This is not oh, like wait. a game. This is not. This is wait, wait, save real it. life. Wait, save what? it. Save it for later. I thought. I thought you meant like a discussion about something different. Oh no. But yeah, but let's talk. <laughs> let's get to the PowerPoint done, and then we'll talk about it. But anyways, we have a Discord server for the entire community to interact with fellow fans and bring suggestions and talk to the host. So yes. And so if you're watching this live on Ghost Welder stream, there's also another Discord that we have for say like for just for the Godcast itself. So I figured I'd let the audience know about that. So I will link it down in the description on my YouTube video so you can go all go check it out. And we have various off series, such as Godcast Highlights, which is a series that's uploaded once every few months that'll be a highlight reel of the best moments of the podcast. So, like, the introduction, the introduction of this video, for instance, is a perfect segue into that, because that's perfect. Godcast parody. It's like highlights, but instead of, instead of highlights, it's more focused on, like, making fun of ourselves. And Godcast plays, which is, which this off series is going to be, this is something that will be recorded in Godcast itself, but it will be, have separate uploads of any major game we played. And I think I know some games that we might be doing on that Godcast play segment. I'm looking at Fortnite. <laughs> and why Godcast? Why should you watch us? It's because I feel like we have a unique dynamic between the three of us. Mainly Hydrowave 99, myself being the critic, Ghostweather Game being the streamer slash let's player, and Alpaca, who is the big memer. And I think this the three dynamic all together is going to make relative Re relevant commentary while our new while also being like hilarious and entertaining and i think we can all agree upon that the fuck you mean i don't i do not consider myself funny a single goddamn bit <laughs> who knows yo did you see that what my my lights just turned off and my fan just turned off uh, I didn't see that, but, uh, fingers crossed not a power outage. But how is he talking to us? True. I don't, I don't know, man. That was, why are you running off your phone with like dead on? <laughs> oh. All right. Well, moving on. We, again, we also have various segments and spinoff series that differentiate the show and we are very community driven and willing to take feedback plus suggestions. And I think that is going to be the end of that. So, with that being said, I think it's time for us to talk about the heist. Ah. Uh. So, so, the last two recordings, we talked about Windows 11 and how we thought it was going to be a good, a solid operating system. But this recording, which is going to be the premiere episode, is going to talk about how over $300,000 worth of RTX 3090s were stolen out of a factory in China. Now, I'm sure as everyone knows, it's from December 7th, 2020, but our good friend Ghost Weather Game has a lot to say on the subject. So, oh, yeah. Ghost, take it away. All right, so, again, this isn't a game, this isn't, like, anything that that's made up. This is a real-life thing. This is... It, I don't know, it blows my mind kind of talking about it. So, there were four factory workers who stole how many, again? 40 containers. How many 3090s? 40, 40 fucking containers of 3090s. RTX 3090s, which if you guys don't know, that is graphics cards. They stole them. They got in a high-speed pursuit on jet skis. <laughs> moved to, mo like to motor vehicle high speed chases until they were apprehend until they were like apprehended which means there were there are over 40 containers of nothing but 3090s locked up and we cannot use them it because they were it is now evidence yeah it makes it even more interesting the fact that the article that our good friend Ghostwire game provided 
three it, the tolling goods were worth around three hundred thirty six thousand five hundred dollars that's nuts and it consists roughly of 200 of those graphics cards so the, and they say due to the high demand you can see that they've been selling for over two thousand dollars on auction on auction sites so think about it this way because with the chip shortage going on these graphic cards that should be worth about thousand five hundred dollars are being sold for like say two thousand dollars or three thousand dollars or five thousand dollars the most i've ever seen was like a six thousand dollar uh was a six thousand dollar graphics card that was that was 3090 rtx yeah and that that whole thing is nuts and if we keep going over here you can see that they put down a hundred thousand yuan bounty, or roughly thirteen uh, or fifteen thousand three hundred fourteen dollars, for anyone who retrieves the items. Yeah, and now it is locked up in an evidence lab, or in a lockup in China. Yeah. So this is pretty insane of a news topic, I think. Even if it's a few months old, this is still a pretty insane topic to think about. Like, Alpaca, what do you think of this whole thing? Um, yeah, let, let me, where, where do I really start? So, um, probably greedy, money-hungry bastards who are just trying to, like, you know, you know probably mine them. They probably weren't even going to, like, sell them. They're probably looking for that, you know, Bitcoin payoff. Um, they stole, like, you know, cases worth of them. And uh, so, so after they sold, after they stole them, you know, a after that, they are never going to be released, because, I guess, because, or, like, they're at least very delayed now because they've been stolen uh but they're they're delayed now because the chinese fbi or whatever or whoever is whoever wants their heads um is holding on to them so it's a lose-lose for everyone because now we now we don't now we we just lost like a a bunch of cases of like graphics cards yeah, and it's so. crazy. it's even like I said, it's even worse because of the chip shorts going on. Like, good luck finding a PS5 and a Series X if you can. I mean, I'm lucky enough to have them. Like, I don't know if anyone can see behind my display there, but there's my PS5 right freaking there. Even though it's AMD based, like, it's still graphics, and it's just like it's been hard to get any sort of graphical like electronic component, like be it like like I said, video game consoles or computer chips. And graphic card even are even worse than finding them. Like, good luck finding any of the 30 series cards. Right now, it's that's hard to find on the freaking consoles. Oh hey, there's a there's a sixty nine thousand XT for like one thousand eight hundred bucks on Newegg right now. <laughs> Don't they go for like twenty five now? What? Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, it's just annoying and just stupid. Anyway, um, but back to that, um. I was just looking at Newegg and looking at this article, but you know, it's like, <laughs> so, um, they could have either sold them or mined them with Bitcoin, um, or for for Bitcoin, um, but get you know, it's just like. <sighs> And I don't know why you would even yeah I was gonna say and I don't even know why you would mind them considering Nvidia literally like was trying to figure was had recently been doing things like stripping them from their mining capabilities so they can't even mine as well. So, I would say selling them yeah. would have made them a lot more revenue than mining them. Oh yeah, but I agree. just think of it, it is absolutely fucking crazy because who knows how deep that impact actually is? Because there are people holding on to thirty nineties, there are people that have you know, a few thousand crates of 3090s already in the U.S., and there are people like like these Chinese assholes, not referring to people like that, but there are people like these Chinese criminals who literally fucking heisted 
crates, fucking crates of 3090s got away for like, I think like roughly like two months. And now they're stuck in evidence locked up. We don't know how deep that impact will be, nor do we know how how that will affect us in the near future for most. Which is just crazy. Yeah. That is absolutely fucking... Yeah. Like, for instance, I was just mentioning... I just, like... Mm. That's okay. Go ahead. I was going to say, I know that my brother, actually, he got himself a 3090 himself, and then someone actually offered him, like, $5,000. He said no to that, because he those graphics cards have that hard to find. Uh, I would have taken the $5,000. <laughs> um, I mean, I, you know, if, if he had nothing else to game on, maybe I understand, but, I mean, just, you know, 1030 Ti, or not, not Ti, there's no such thing, uh, a 1030 will suffice, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Um, I mean, uh, all three of us have 1660 supers on our computers, and yeah, just and I and I'm planning on upgrading my computer sometime, probably in the next year or two, because well, I plan on upgrading mine by the end of like a few weeks. What do you mean? Or are you gonna try? I'm gonna to... upgrade mine when I can. Can I can? I guess. Hmm. I'm I'm gonna try to hunt down like a like a twenty sixty or something. Let's get back to normal from here anyway. So you're not gonna hunt. Definitely gonna try to hunt. So you're not gonna try hunt, hunt down a thirty ninety. Fuck no. Not thirty nine, but maybe like the thirty eighty or thirty seventy. You're not gonna try hunt down for Absolutely those. Absolutely not. No, just mm-hmm. something a little bit higher. I'll, I'll work my way up. For me, I was just thinking either a sixty seven thousand XT when it. You know, stops costing a thousand dollars, goes back to five hundred. Um, because I could buy two if it wasn't for inflated prices <laughs> for mm. that price. So, right. um, the uh, though this this Merc 319 here it looks like a good deal. I just need uh, you know, one thousand six hundred dollars more, or an arm and a leg. <laughs> Or or that, I'll just sell my I'll I'll just sell my fucking appendix. <laughs> you know, actually, um, I heard you can live without that stuff, so maybe. <laughs> yeah, I. I all right. So I've had a few close calls where my appendix nearly bursted, but um, luckily it didn't. Um, but uh, yeah, no, you can put out your appendix. Yeah. Oh my god, the appendix is such a terrible fucking thing. You know, back then, you know, it could be used to process seeds, and nowadays it's like, it just gets infected every once in a while and kills you if you don't get it taken care of. Like, what the fuck? Mm, yeah. You know, I, I asked my brother this, and he said, oh, it's because evolution isn't perfect, but it's just like, yes, I understand that, but this is a thing that kills people <laughs> right? if they don't get it taken care of, so it's like, fuck's sake. Yeah. Uh, I, I think the human body can kill somebody. <laughs> All right. I think, oh yeah. I think allergies. I was gonna say. All right. I think at this point, I think we got through like every relevant topic regarding this news article. I think we all agree. Yeah. So, do you want to a bit more? Or do you want to end the show for today? Oh no, we can definitely chat. We can definitely chat a bit more. Go a bit more for this. Just my comrades. Of course. That's the nice thing about a podcast is that we can chat as long as we want. So, if we want to keep chatting throughout the podcast. We can go ahead and do so. Yeah. Because, I mean, we're at the 19-minute mark. Yeah, and editing it down and splicing it will we'll take down, like, 5 to 10 minutes, most. Maybe. I'm at 29. I mean, I'm for, at 13 minutes. I mean, for me, because I record later, I'm at 19 minutes, so I'm going to upload my version cut shorter. Even, even though it's a... Yeah, your screen is moist. Yeah. Oh, God, that's disgusting. Sorry. <laughs> no, no, you're good. Um, but yeah, is there anything else you want, guys want to talk about? Be it, like, anything relevant or anything? Moist touch screens. Ah, there we go, there we go. Okay, okay. My, my phone has literally sweated, and I can't touch anything. It slides. I feel like I'm using an ice phone. <laughs> uh, ice uh, phone 11. Or 12, or whatever Apple's up to right now. I see. 13. 13. <laughs> 
Well, the nice thing about uh, that's an unlucky number. Anyway, sorry. But, uh, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. But I feel like this is going to be a very interesting show for the three of us. Like, I honestly do think so. I mean, yeah, we recorded the same thing like three times besides the new article. But honestly, I think this is going to be a great show for all three of us. I guess so. It'll, it'll be like. It, it, it's like, I don't know. If anyone likes bologna, it's like putting bologna in your sandwich. Mm. Yeah, like... It just adds sustenance. <laughs> yeah. I don't but, know. But I think the nice thing about this show is that you're getting something from, like, people. Like, you're not getting anything from journalists. You're just getting a raw reaction from people who are interested in technology. Yeah. And it's... I, I guess I can say this for the podcast... It's as genuine as it's going to get. Like, we're not professionals. That's what makes it fucking hilarious. Is that none of us really consider each, like, like none of us consider each other like professionals at this. Or we haven't been doing this for long enough to call each other like a, a professional viewer of technology or any any of those means. So it's just if we think it's dumb, we're going to call it out as it is. Exactly. I mean, unless for some reason we have Elon Musk sending us Teslas over. We're going to, uh, look, unless that happens, we're just going to stay the same as we are. Like, don't get me wrong. I love chill like Review Tech USA or Spawn Wave or Linus Tech Tips, et cetera, et cetera. But at the same time, it's nice to be able to just have a more chill and more casual environment where you're just talking with your two best friends about yeah. the same things that we're all interested in. You know what's also interesting? The segue to our sponsor. Sorry. <laughs> Alexa Science. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's fun. Just imagine if this show actually got successful enough that we actually did get sponsored. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> oh, oh no, I would, I would hopefully overdose by that, <laughs> by then, you know. Right, because I swear my fame will only Jeff last Bezos, so long. Uh, Jeff Bezos had a threesome with all of us, except it was a quad sum. <laughs> Let's get into it. <laughs> <laughs> all right oh oh no if we're talking about jeff bezos right so there was an article on on there's a there's an article on how he's like the the world's like most like he's the wealthiest man on on the planet and as i was as i was clicking on the fucking page i i i thought it was a dick i swear to god i thought it was a dick <laughs> <laughs> It was just his head was slowly loading in frame by frame on my fucking computer. <laughs> yo, 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 wrong website, wrong website. And then my chat was, yo, no, you're on the right one. Look, look at the fucking source code. Oh my! It's like that. It's like that one image of a. Uh, it's a. It's a girl kissing her cat's paw, but it looks like she's taking in a BBC. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so, yeah. Aww. All right. Um, do we have anything else to say before we close the show, or should we? Is there anything else we want to talk about, real quick? Moist click screens. <laughs> uh, McDonald's uh, uh, touch screens. Why do they suck? <laughs> uh, cool. Who knows? Maybe Why? we could find something on the McDonald's touch screens in, in a future episode. We could actually talk about them. McDonald's automated AI drive through Whew. Hey, McDonald's. <laughs> they put me a McChicken. Bag at you. <laughs> they shoot the bag out of a cannon. <laughs> oh, my God. That's hilarious. Go get right. a paper, a fucking Big Mac. Yeah, I hear you. All right. Big um, Mac can butter. Big Ma. Big Ma. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, German fucking McDonald's. I would like a, I would like a big mom. All right, I believe we're about to hit the twenty-five minute mark. So, and this is supposed to be a ten to fifteen minute episode. So I feel like we had a lot to talk about today, despite it being only one news topic and just showing us, showing the audience the chemistry between all three of us. So, well, for the people that are watching, I'm sorry. You know, it gets hi, mom. Soon. Oh, it's only this show's only gonna get more toxic as time goes on. It's gonna be great. Oh my god, yeah, it's gonna get so fucking scuffed. <laughs> Where's that picture? I'm I'm trying to find that picture. 
Maybe I actually got flagged by AI. <laughs> oh no. Alright. Um, do we dare show it oh, to the fuck. audience or do we save it for next time? Oh no, we oh, don't. What the fuck the is audience. that? We set the bar. <laughs> I got these fucked up pictures. It's a cat with like <laughs> cranberry it's sauce on its eyeball. <laughs> it, it looks like it has cherry fucking pie <laughs> for an eye. It's a cat, but it looks like Mark Zuckerberg surfing. <laughs> Let's see. What the fuck? Why is that not a flag? But, oh. It is. Oh, is that the grapefruit technique? <laughs> <laughs> yes. No. I don't know. Why the fuck is there a cat with a diaper on? That's Kuiper. <laughs> cat Kuiper. <laughs> Kuiper. Oh, uh, man. This is... Uh, what a session, Arbor. What the fuck? Why, why aren't these... Jesus Christ. Yeah, what a session, everybody. This is this is the kind of content you, you, you come here and subscribe for if you want exciting podcasts, I would say. We're setting the bar real low. Yeah. Hope, I mean, not really. Hopefully, it's very high. That uh, way, when people expect stuff, they're disappointed. <laughs> 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 yeah. All right. Well, you want to go through the McDonald's drive-thru? You set the bar so high, but when you open the bag, you're disappointed. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, I don't think we have much else to talk about today. So, until. So, the story is that besides today, we're going to try and record episodes every Saturday. So, like somewhere on Saturday night, in hopes of being able to upload it Sunday. So. Until then, uh, if you if you like what you saw, please come comment and subscribe, and also check us out on Discord where you can interact with us among other fans and give us suggestions. Until then, I am Hydroim ninety nine. I am Fluff Alpaca, not Floof. <laughs> Call me fucking Fluff, you bastard. <laughs> Floof Alpaca, <laughs> yeah, man. Fucking hell, it's Fluff Alpaca. I, maybe it looks like I have like an ooh. From like the German um lots, but no. <laughs> and, then You're a cunt. <laughs> and then we also have Ghost World of Game on the other side, and until then, we'll see you all next week. Bye everyone. Bye. <laughs>